the red corner, Jay Kerwin in the blue, Stuart Green. And both men working behind the jab in the centre of the ring there. Feeling out process here early in the opening round. A nice foot movement from both and good stiff jabs from both men. They both landed, so both men has an idea of what the other is about at the moment. Here early in the opening round. And I like the fact both men got nice foot movement. Teasing, waiting for that shot, trying to lure the other man onto a shot and then replying. And as you can see, both men relying heavily on the jab. Looking to work behind it to build everything else. And away they go again. And doubling up the jab this time, Kerwin in the red. And then left and right from Green in the blue. Pushing forward now, but nice foot movement from Kerwin in defence. Skips out of the way of those shots, and he needed to because that was a good left hook. But he saw it coming. And they've worked their way well into this round. Taking their time, had a good look at each other, not let the nerves get to them. And Kerwin just warned for holding there. And away they go once more. And it's that left hook, it's a danger from Green. Kerwin will have to watch for that. Tucks up as Green comes forward. Nice response from Kerwin on the turn. And a nice stiff jab from Kerwin this time to end the round. So two of three, very close, even opening round. Both men opting to work a lot behind the jab, but Kerwin looking to open up here in the second. Now Green looks to respond. So both men have upped their game and upped the pace here in the second from that opener. And that was a good shot left and right from Green, and you heard the response there, got through the channel. And away they go once more. Green just forcing the pace a little bit for me here in the second. Asking a few questions of Kerwin now. And that left lands cleanly after the left-right combination. Kerwin needs to get back behind that jab to keep his man away because Green is pushing forward and probing. As he did there, that left didn't land but the right did, so Green just beginning to turn up the heat here in the second after a very even opening round. And again, Green pushes forward, he closes the gap quickly and starts to get his shots off. Rights and lefts as Kerwin tucks up. And pushing forward once more. So, I had the opening round very close, but I've got Stuart Green beginning to, to move ahead here in the second with consistent pressure and aggression here that Kerwin matched in the first, but hasn't been as successful matching in the second. Hasn't got behind that good jab as much here in the second. And Green has exploited that fact and used it to his advantage. So, I've got daylight between them as we come to the end of the second round now. And Kerwin will be have to get back to his good jab in the third. So third and final round. And I've got Green ahead, but Kerwin, this is better. This is what he needs to do, get back in it and make this close once more. But Green probing, pushing forward again, taking centre ring, doubling up that jab. Then turns it to a hook, pushing forward again, just misses with the hook this time. That's better from Kerwin, countering nicely. Close around again. As you saw there, Kerwin making much more of it when, when he steps in after the jab. 
stops Green coming forward so much. And now this is a closer round again. I had definite daylight in the second between the two. Green still sticking to the tactics that work so well for him in the second. Pushes the man back and working. Kerwin can't allow this. He's got himself back into this round well. He's got to make sure he stays that way. Takes a deep breath as Green comes forward once more. Lands with the left hook, but Kerwin responds this time and lands cleanly back. So we've had a close first round, we've got a close third round. With me, Green, taking a solid second round. And away they go once more. And again, Green just looking to force the issue and come forward, throwing the heavy leather, and that left hook is a danger for Kerwin. Tucks up tight, looks to probe with his own jab once more. And Green... Again, a solid finish to the third here as he did the second. And for that reason, I think the Blue's going to take this bout. Close two rounds of the three, but for me, this finish to this round and the second round is going to give Stuart Green the win here. Only my opinion. And your winner by unanimous decision in the blue corner. Stuart 